guess what? You can be drunk without drinking. You might say, how the hell is that possible? If you have a condition called autobrewery syndrome. This is Dr. Wick Ramasinga, a Staten Island-based gastroenterologist who specializes in the treatment of this disorder. The symptoms one gets with autobrewery syndrome are identical to the well-known symptoms of getting drunk. They may be unsteady on their feet, speech may be slurred, they may be falling around, they may get a seizure, they may throw up. Autobrewery syndrome or ABS is an extremely rare disorder where patients have such high levels of yeast and fungus in their gut that when they eat carbs and sugar, the gut ferments it into alcohol. Dr. Rick Ramasinga believes that ABS is triggered by antibiotics, which disrupt the flora in the gut, allowing the growth of fungus and yeast to take over. For his patients, it's been a journey. Can you imagine being pulled over by police and failing a breathalyzer test? or smelling like alcohol while being sober for years. Many of his patients have DWIs, have lost their jobs, and have even faced prison time for being drunk, despite not actually having taken a sip of alcohol. ABS can also cause internal complications, just like alcoholism does. This includes liver damage, a fatty liver, and chronic pancreatitis. Dr. Rick Ramasinga said the condition is chronic unless treated properly, but that treatment isn't invasive. It just takes a combination of low-carb diets and antifungals to give the healthy gut bacteria a chance to grow back. And while the condition is rare, the doctor said it's always a good idea to only take antibiotics when absolutely necessary and prescribed by a physician. You go with a runny nose or sn sniffles or coughing and somebody gives you an antibiotic. Most of these conditions are actually viral diseases which do not need an antibiotic. Antibiotics do nothing for it, but they have the side effect of damaging your microbiome, loving fungi to overgrow.